Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new YouTube video. I hope you guys are all doing well. Today guys, we are going to be talking the Callisto Protocol and its ending, how it could lead to some DLC or DLC potential ideas. Two really quick side notes that I do want to mention really quickly. Please go finish the ending of the Callisto Protocol because I will be talking spoilers in this video and I'm not going to be holding back. That is your only warning. Without further ado, let's get right into this. So I'm going to assume if you're still watching this video and you haven't clicked off, then you obviously have finished the ending of the Callisto Protocol. Now, after Danny is cured, the two rush to flee the facility as its self-destruct sequence is activated. There's only one escape pod, so Jacob puts Danny inside, giving her a sample of the virus to prove what Cole is doing and shoots her into space. At this moment, the link between Jacob and Danny fully sinks. In the end, we see a hologram of Dr. Mahler talking to Jacob, explaining that there's another way off of Callisto that, and he needs to trust her. And then we see Captain Ferris scared Jacob. So that's the ending explained. Now, where does this lead into DLC? Now, first things first, the ending is quite honestly disappointing. If you ask me, the game is getting set up to have a sequel and that's okay, man. That's okay. There's nothing wrong with that. You know, a lot of games have cliffhangers, but a lot of games don't have cliffhangers in the way that the Callisto protocol does. The ending quite honestly feels like it's setting up for DLC and it's going to have a paywall quite honestly and that's probably one of the most disappointing things to hear because the Callisto Protocol is one of those games that I was very highly anticipating but as soon as I completed it it was just super disappointing. Now let's get back on track guys where we are talking about the DLC potential. Where I feel like this is going to be going is we're going to be getting a prologue prequel story to the events of the Callisto Protocol. I would say those years between the main game and what happened to the colonists. Now, the colonists are the first people to experience the Callisto Protocol's first actual attack. If I, again, I don't want to go into too much spoilers in this video because i just want you guys to experience that on your own quite honestly but when they find the monster and you'll know what i'm talking about i want to see a story centering on them detailing a lot of the stuff that happened you can tie in it to the main game that's just one idea the second way i think that they are most likely going to handle this and i don't like this one but i think it's just the most reasonable one is obviously jacob finding an alternate way off of callisto and him trying to escape just like dr Mahler had that plan and maybe he actually finds ferris or has to battle ferris again and ferris's story is kind of left up in the air because he does scare jacob but again there's not too much to go off of from there or lastly maybe we pick up some time between the ending of the game and maybe a couple months or a couple days after and we're picking up where danny is maybe she's on a spaceship maybe she's crash landed somewhere else or maybe she's up in space the mystery is unknown honestly but she still has the sample and maybe she still has some monsters after her i'm just throwing some ideas out there and i don't know where it could go but maybe that's just something that they could do again we don't know where danny is or what happened to her the be the best conclusion that we can get is that she got off to safety and is exposing her story if you know what i'm talking about and what happened at the events of black iron prison now all right, guys, that's going to have to wrap up today's video. I definitely hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did enjoy it, please consider leaving a like, subscribing if you guys are new. And without further ado, guys, I hope you guys have a great night and take care.